first day. And I'll be seeing you here soon with all the songs of the incomparable Gus Kahn, the man who set his dreams to the lyrics the world will always sing. Come in. Aren't you folks going to have supper? We're making one My name is Danny Thomas, and I'll be seeing you in that wonderful era of humor and laughter when everybody was making whoopee. The time when there was no business like show business and no showman like Gus Kahn. Love me or leave me and let me be lonely. You won't be lonely and I love you only. I'm Patrice Wymore. I'll see you at curtain time in the big Broadway playhouses where the songs of Gus Kahn have highlighted the great Siegfeld Follies, Showgirl, Whoopi, and many other great hits. said that you love me? Well, gosh, what do you want? Moon, June, love, dove? That's my business all day. Mr. Khan. Yeah? Let's get down to business. I'm Frank Lovejoy. I'll see you here soon when this screen tells the whole rich, warm, wonderful story of a man whose song said, I love you for sweethearts the world over. And he didn't have the courage to say it to his own girl. Loves a baby, that's why I'm in love with you, pretty baby. Tut tut tut, say goodbye. You know my sweetheart now. They don't, baby, you somehow. Nothing could be finer than to be in Carolina in the morning. The one I love belongs to somebody else. adventure that takes you through Manhattan's grandest canyon. From Greenwich Village night spots to Gotham's starlit roofs, from fabulous Times Square through the golden gates of show business, where Gershwin, Cole Porter, De Silva, Warren and Jubin set the heartbeat of the big town to great music. And with you on this jubilant jamboree, delightful Doris Day, bringing romance and rhythm to every exciting moment. Gene Nelson tiptoe tapping his gay right way along the great white way. S.C. Sackle, Billy DeWolf, Gladys George. What will your wife think? You taking a blonde and giving her a room in your home. You mean you think she would think that I? Oh, thank you. That's the nicest thing anyone has said to me in 15 years. What did you say your name was? I love the way you say good night. The way you always whisper, honey, nighty night. It was just one of those things, just one of those crazy flings. 
all nature seemed to be in perfect harmony. Zing, zing, went the strings of my heart. Somebody loves me. I wonder who. Sense a dance to a place in the spotlight. The fabulous story of Ruth Etting, a determined girl reaching for fame and fortune, singing her way into the hearts of a nation. From the mob rule days of Chicago's lurid past to the glitter of the Zig Bell Folly. To win the bears away, to take the cares away. If you would lose your weary blue, shake them away. Behind the glamour and adulation, Ruth Edding lived another life in a shadowy world, dominated by a fierce little man who was crazy with love for her, Marty the Gimp Snyder, a mysterious and dangerous man that no one really knew. Whoever I am, kiddo, I'm what makes you tick. And don't you ever forget that. Then let me help. I'll get you to the right people. I'll work with you. They'll want you. Don't worry. They won't have to be strong-armed or blackmailed or shoved around. They'll want you because you're good. Oh, try it, Ruth. Try it that way. You got what you wanted. I brought you this far. I did. Nobody else. But that don't count. Not with you. A high-class dame like you. Love Me or Leave Me is the picture you will talk about. A new entertainment sensation that critics and preview audiences have acclaimed the musical that is more than a musical because it is a drama about real people. James Cagney, with his aggressive characterization of Marty the Gimp, renews the hard-hitting, smashing sort of portrayal that first brought him fame. This is his best. The dramatic perfection of Doris Day's performance is an unforgettable treat. Her singing, sensational, as she thrills you with the songs that will forever belong to Ruth Eddy. Absolutely nothing in common except a party line. Oh, would you please get off this line? They believe passionately in the motto, hate thy neighbor. Look, I don't know what's bothering you, but don't take your bedroom problems out on me. 
Then he met the body that went with the voice he hated. What would you do? That's what he did. Pretend he was two other guys. And then the wooing got frantic. Starring Tony Randall. Well, they didn't hit the moon with the first missile shot either. And Thelma Ritter in the most sparkling sexcapade that ever winked at convention. Bedroom problems. At least mine can be solved in one bedroom. You couldn't solve yours in a thousand. Hear Doris Day sing these hit tunes with an assist by rock. I'm yours tonight, my darling. Possess me. I call it Yaya ya, Rolling, Rolling, Yaya ya, Rolling, Rolling, Yaya ya, Rolling, Rolling. Are you getting out of that bed or am I coming in after you? He wouldn't dare. I'm just a slave to any man who uses vip. I don't use sex to land an account. When do you use it? Oversexed? Mm -hmm. He claims you're... Well, I'm not undersexed. I'm sure you're not. This time, they're competing in the mad advertising world of Madison Avenue and its madder inhabitants. To wit, Tony Randall. You're one of the lucky ones. You were born in the slums. But I started at the top. I've done it the hard way. Edie Adams, the VIP girl. I am not your sugar lump. And stop nibbling on me. Jack Oakey, the well-entertained sponsor. The Glen Hava Show! <laughs> On your feet, Yankees! <laughs> Jack Crucian as the scientist, Dr. Linus Tyler. I will never again prostitute my genius. But the laughs become positively explosive <laughs> when Doris mistakes Rock for the scientist. She acting so sophisticated, he acting so naive. But who's kidding who? Where's he taking you? kind of a nightclub, and they have these girls, and they re remove their... They strip. I know a place where Webster would never find you. In your apartment? Alone with you? All night? Well, I... I don't know. Oh, oh Linus. We're adults. Yes. You go to jail for this! No, Carol. Oh, don't you touch me! Just try it. It's nice. Come, come Christopher, on. you're rushing me. I always wait at least an hour after eating. Caprice, a whimsical perfume. Does it swing? It's a swinging bed. And it swings Doris Day and Richard Harris into a whirlpool of color, 
danger and love. Caprice. Ski. She. Or spy. Caprice is, uh, is unpredictable. Take off your trousers. Doris may have a whim for love, but she has a terrific talent for danger. <laughs> Is that what he wants you to find out? That's why you've been asking me all these questions today. Matt Cutter sent you to spy on me, didn't he? You're going to have access to all kinds of uh, secret information working in my plan. Now, I wouldn't employ you if I thought you couldn't be trusted. Well, don't just stand there. Don't you realize the enormity of your crime? Richard Harris has a whim for danger. But has a wonderful talent for women. Caprice is a gun with a silencer. Caprice is a girl in a strange bed. Caprice is a skier in black. Caprice is a stab in the back. Caprice is a bugged sugar cube. Caprice is a wild helicopter ride. Caprice is a cliffhanger. Caprice is Doris Day on the land. And remember, it swings. Caprice. This year's Academy Award winner, Grace Kelly. Two exciting personalities who were made for each other. And now, Alfred Hitchcock brings them into very close contact in this perfect tale of romantic intrigue, filmed on the beautiful French Riviera. You have a very strong grip, the kind of burglar needs. That's why you came out here, isn't it? The scandalous romance that shocked even the blasé international set between this restless, thrill-hunting American heiress and the notorious man of mystery the French underworld called the Cat. For the game they played was not played for money, and the characters they played with played for keeps. No one but Hitchcock could create such relentless excitement, filling the screen with fireworks as he matches the blazing talents of these two great stars in the love affair of the year. Look, John, hold them, diamonds. Have you ever had a better offer in your whole life? One with everything. <laughs> 